In Maine, we know to be on the lookout for things like ticks and the brown tail moth. Now there's evidence that there's a new invasive pest that's making its way to Maine. It's called the spotted lanternfly, and agriculture officials are urging people to be on the lookout. It's kind of a monster of an insect in terms of all the things that it can do. File this under only in 2020. It's quite a charismatic little insect. It's so beautiful in itself, but unfortunately it can wreak havoc. These egg masses are from an invasive pest called the spotted lanternfly. It sucks the juices out of the plants. and Gary Fish the is the state horticulturist. Horrible things that it does in Pennsylvania is that it swarms onto trees and there's you know, thousands of them. And as they all together are pooping out this kind of clear liquid that is full of sugar. This sounds like something out of Ghostbusters or like the mummy. <laughs> and then eventually it attracts ants and it attracts all kinds of stinging insects. The egg masses were found on trees from Pennsylvania, where the pest has already been established. A New Hampshire nursery purchased the trees, and then those trees were planted. Some in the spring, some later in the summer. In Booth Bay, Freeport, Northeast Harbor, and Yarmouth. It's very difficult to see, and, and that's probably the reason why we ended up with these egg masses in the state of Maine, is that the Pennsylvania nursery was removing them, but they, they missed some. It can attack over 100 different species of plants, like landscape plants or grapes, apples, and peaches. The Maine Department of Agriculture, Conservation, and Forestry is asking people to be on the lookout for large gray insects about an inch long with black spots and red underwings, or inch long yellowish brown egg masses covered with a gray wax coating. You'll know that it's quite different from anything else you've probably ever seen. So far, no live spotted lanternflies have been found in Maine. You can report potential sightings to bugwatch at maine.gov. These insects also serve as a reminder as to why out-of-state firewood is banned. The Department of Agriculture, Conservation and Forestry says to use local Maine firewood if you have already transported firewood into Maine, burn it. Please do not leave it or bring it home. If you can't burn it all within 24 hours, bring it to the nearest drop off site. Burn local or heat treated firewood and check out the website Firewood Scout for more information.